I'm Tammy Bradford. I'm the manager here at the Preston Museum and I'm very excited to be able to launch our next project, 40 Years, 40 Voices. What this is, is a way of celebrating our 40th year by collecting the stories from people whose stories we have not been telling in the past. Uh, like many museums, we have done an excellent job of telling the stories of typical European settlers, but those aren't the only stories in the community. So we're trying very hard to reach out to groups who don't represent your typical European settler and get them to tell us a bit about their stories and their histories. And what I've got here are just a few of the photos that we have in our collection that represent other cultures other than the, the European settler. And you can just see on the edge of this one, one of the, in fact, I think it's the only photo that we've got that shows one of the black conductors and uh, train car attendants on the CPR trains. We've also got this one, which if you look really closely at the man on the very right hand side, you can see he's wearing a turban. He's a Sikh or Hindu worker on a farm out on the flats in 1929. Probably a Sikh. And unfortunately, we know nothing about him. We know nothing about the black conductors. We know virtually nothing about the Chinese cooks or the laundrymen or the restaurant owners who have been here in Preston. So one of the things that we're doing with this project is trying to get past that anonymity and at the same time reach out to people in the community today who represent some of these different perspectives, some of these different cultures, the ones that we haven't been connecting with and get them in here. So the room that we're in now is going to be completely cleared out. And we've got a few other people here today who will be telling you a bit more about their stories and the projects that they are working on. Okay, this is a gavel that was um, made by, uh, from one of the first apple trees in Creston. And it really reminded me of my grandpa. So my grandpa um, brought the apple seeds when he used to live in Indonesia. So my dad was born and raised in Indonesia and my Grandpa brought apple seeds over to Indonesia, and um, now there's this whole flourishing place in Java, which is an apple community, um, and he had his horticulture degree, so this was the first apple wood to Preston gavel, and it was, yeah, it just reminded me of my grandpa.